I went on a pump when I was in seventh grade. For 18 years, Heidi Button has needed insulin to lower her blood sugars and to stay alive. But like most type 1 diabetics, she fears her blood sugars could go too low. It just takes one low blood sugar to kill you. One in 20 type 1 diabetics will die of a low blood sugar. That's 411 people every day. Or they may be in a deep sleep and not know about it and therefore not respond. That's where this technology comes in. Up to now, the uh, glucose sensing devices and the pumps um, haven't been connected in that they, 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 they don't talk to each other and do something about that blood sugar. Now, if a patient doesn't respond to a low blood sugar alarm, the VAO pump automatically shuts off insulin delivery for up to two hours. That should be long enough to allow the blood glucose levels to return to normal. The device has helped Heidi when her alarm didn't wake her up. And I slept right through it and I had no idea that my blood sugar was low. Dr. Ruth Weinstock says the VAO could save lives. We hope that this would prevent those unnecessary deaths. I'm Andrew McIntosh reporting.